Xander Root can stay. Here's where a here's where Gabe used to live. Okay, there's got to be like something here, right? Where where's the, where's the thing pointing me? I don't see it. Wait, there it is. What? What? Do I just grab the dish? Do I grab Gabe's bowl? That is what I needed. Yes? There! We need to return that to Dr. Boris when we get a chance. I'm still kind of curious what's going on around here. But hey, we found something. And that's always good. Finding something. Everybody here is ODing. That is definitely what it looks like to me. I think I need energy cells. God, they weigh a ton, though. They weigh so much. I'll probably drop some of those later on. Yeah, the energy cells are what's, like, weighing me down so much. But that, yeah, That's what I need for the uh, sonic emitter. Isn't it? Sonic emitter? Energy cells. Yeah, look how many of those I have. Ugh, critical strike paralysis. That's actually what's what's scaring me here. I think I can just drop the laser rifle and be good. So that, yeah, it doesn't repair into anything anyway. All right. So we are done in Higgs Village, which was actually pretty interesting. I was surprised at how interesting it was. Uh, but before I leave, I was told there was a hollow tape back in the uh, medical facility. So I'm going to head back there, hopefully quickly. Hopefully. Uh, research center. Where is the lab? There it is. Medical facility. Once I have these places marked, I, I don't like running back. Seems like a little bit of a waste of time. Although it does take away from the exploration a bit. Okay, so I was told that over here, on the ground, outside the sh one of the cells... There was a super sludge. There was a hollow tape. Hey, there it is. Patient log 17.0. Still doesn't necessarily seem worth it, but it's there. Actually, can I repair using this super sludge while I'm here? It probably puts me over. Indeed, it does. I can. Very nice. Probably not entirely worth it, but we'll see. All right, hollow tape. Uh, which was... Okay, here. This is Christine Royce. Knight of the Brotherhood of Steel. The Circle. Ah. Not going to make it through this. Hope someone finds this message. Gets it to the Brotherhood in the West. Tracked a rogue Brotherhood elder, Elijah, here to the Big Empty. <sighs> scattered across the crater's surface all still running like this one Elijah's dissecting these centers Crap. one by one well wow. to an old Chinese American internment camp survivors ghouls have bomb collars I'm trying to let her talk here robots moved in when I tried to intercept him Elijah sent the camp ghouls against us both, like walking bombs. Got hit by the explosions, oh, woke up here. Guess the medical robots were programmed to bring wounded victims from the camp to this center. Some kind of autodoc prototype lab, manned by corpses trapped inside suits that keep them moving. No idea why. Not sure how long I'm going to last. Cut open my head like a lot of the humans I've seen here. Feel strange. Can talk, but can't hack the term. Is she done? Okay, uh, I set off like Wait, 30 enemies. an explosion outside. Someone's here. Someone's okay, so that, that was interesting. At least we got a name for that person, but uh... Things definitely aren't going to be working out so well I'm for me here. I'm, a very lethal killing machine. I'm sure you are, Robobrain. Uh, we're going to hit you in the torso three times, though. 
Hey, a critical strike. That's good. The dogs, though. How many dogs do there need to be in a given area? Okay, down that one goes. There goes my arm. We will be dealing with that at some point. Hit the cyber dog in the head. Hey, there we go. Critical strike, and I should be able to finish it off here. Shit, are you kidding me? I think I need to rest. That'll help with my limb condition. Because seriously, these things, my limbs apparently are just dying all over the place. I also need to get my uh, armor repaired. Okay, time to heal. Probably was time to heal a little bit ago, but uh, we're healing now. So that'll help. What is this mutant cave fungus? That's not going to be really good. Uh, two for 30 seconds, though. That'll, that'll last me the length of this fight, hopefully. What, like, I'm. How am I over? What the hell? I lost some of my weight. Some of my strength has been sapped. And we're still not done here. No, no. Yeah, I know that I'm crippled. I'm dealing with it. Okay, down you go. It's just up to you up there. This thing does not have good durability, though. I have, like, I've taken off so much of its condition just by using it. What, I used a super stim pack? I didn't mean to do that. All right, uh, we'll use what that Brahmin steak, because that'll help. And purified water, and a regular stim pack. Okay, let's change weapons as well. Let's go with the shotgun. 95% chance. There we go. Down he goes. I don't think they're going to have anything that I particularly want. But the other dog sees me. How many dogs do you need, man? Are you kidding me? That did crap. He's not even really all that aggressive. He's just chilling. Alright, hit him in the head three times. That should finish him off. Down he goes. Now it's time to head back to the sink. We are done here. We are done. Just, well, it doesn't really matter. We're going to the balcony. Not that it really matters where I go to, but damn it, we are done with this. I went where I need to go. Now I need to go back and, and deal with all the loss of everything that I have. Okay. So I have something for the book shoot. Ah, good day, citizen. Library Processing Unit 232.7 is online and ready to eradicate sedition. Really? Sedition? That's what your role is? Of course, citizen. That's my duty and sole joy in life. All those books from before the war, full of seditious, treasonous, complicated thoughts, just dump them in and lickety-split. I'll have them pumped, scrubbed clean, and pressed out again clean and white and sedition-free. He's a book burner. Okay. Uh, do you do anything else? What good is eradicating sedition if the malcontents have ready access to the means to make more, citizen? I can also process pencils and clipboards. Wait a moment. Pencil processors offline? Pencil processors offline? Apologies, citizen. It seems traitors have absconded with that module. Damn traitors. If you can find a backup copy of the module, I will happily eradicate your ability to create seditious literature. Okay, what's the point of making blank books? Blank books are better for the mind, citizen. Real science by real men in lab coats has proved that introducing outside thoughts confuses the brain. Of course that Blank does. Blank books encourage the reader not to question, but to blindly and zealously accept what's put in front of him. That sounds awesome. Also, I suppose you could use them to keep a journal. Yeah, you can't destroy them. Citizen, 
That sounds dangerously seditious. If my reindoctrination module was installed, I'd take care of that for you. Sadly, that system was cut for budget concerns, so you'll have to perform your own indoctrination. I'll do that. Now, to begin with, you'll need a cage that can fit over your head and a sack of mole rats. Yeah, I think I can find a use for blank books. Now you're thinking like a citizen, citizen. I, I don't know what the point of blank books is. Questions are dangerously close to independent thought, citizen. Oh, is there an independent thought alarm? All right, we're done with Stay you. Stay loyal, citizen. I, I don't know if I'm actually supposed to get, like, blank books from him or not. All right. You require some addition. Yes. Engage my services and, and heal me. Uh, just basic physical exam. That repairs you my limbs, right? Any communists in your backyard? You're not looking hard enough. All right, now we can uh, install the uh, jukebox. Ooh, yeah, dig that sweet music. Damn, it's good to be back on live. You from the seventies, dude? Your, what's your purpose? Dig, I'm an acoustical wizard kid. Old Doc Moe used me to prototype his sonic weapon designs. Get me a good sample base to work from, and I can whip up a way that makes Jericho look like a kazoo. Who's Jericho? Uh, can you do anything like that for me? Got yourself a sonic emitter, don't you? Thought so. Bring that old thing on in here, and... Bring me some sound samples and I'll make that baby sing. I got a couple of those. Or scream, <laughs> if that's what you want. I'm not fucking the emitter, dude. Okay, uh, I found a sound wave file for you. Right on, daddy-o. Just plug it in and I'll mix you up a sweet, sweet sound. Okay, opera emitter, Gabriel's bark, and the tarantula. Okay, wh what does this do? Right on, Daddy. Let's spin some groove. Because you haven't really told me what it does. Okay. Uh, apparently I can have multiple Sonic Emitters. I have Revelation here. Uh, what, what does it do? What do these do? What does the opera singer do? Like, you're not telling me these things. These are important things. Critical kill dismemberment. Okay. What's the haps? That's new. Let's let's do that again. Uh, give him the opera singer. Turn it into Gabriel's bark. Okay. What does that do? Critical strike knockback. That's not good. That's not what I want. What's the haps? Okay. Recalibrate. Gabriel's bark. Turn it into tarantula. Okay, what does Tarantula do? Critical Strike Incendiary. Actually, I think that's what I want. Plus, it fully repaired it for me, so... What's the haps? This is definitely what I want to stick with. All right, do you play music? Mm, used to. Long time ago. Then old Doc Moe ripped out my music drives and stuck in more acoustical processors. Guess you could say, I got the blues, even if I can't play them no more. You got the blues about playing the blues, I understand. Get you later, Gator. Okay, so I think that was all that I picked up that in terms of personality files that I can deal with. All right, so here's a pre-war book. Do I have anything for Muggy? I don't have anything for Muggy. All right, here's a pre-war book. Let's give that to the book shoot, see what that does. Greetings, citizen. Ready to receive seditious materials. I have some seditious material for you to process. Fantastic, citizen. Just input your quantity of seditious material on my interface, and in no time at all, I'll have you a beautiful, clean book. Won't that keep you happy and docile, citizen? Maybe. Okay, process books. Pre-war book removed. Blank book added. What is the purpose of this? Okay, blank book. I'm sure I've missed a couple of those uh, spheres. Like, what's the point? It doesn't do anything. It's the same price and everything. Like, if I drop it, I can't tell the difference. You ever heard of Tiny Lester 
Really? He's gonna be doing that all the time? Alright. Might I be of service, sir? Can you you can repair things. Right? And you can repair this. Nineteen thousand caps, are you kidding me? I can't even afford most of this. That is ridiculous. Okay. Wow. Might I be of service, sir? Gonna need to play a lot more caravan, apparently. We're gonna we're gonna save state our way to victory there. Very good, sir. And um uh, what I want to do is uh, give you the scrubs, and I'll be good, because I, I don't really need that. Okay, so with that done, that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. I've been Baller Scoop. I've been joined, as always, by the bald traveler, the killer of so many scorpions and dogs for whatever reason. Mike Benrado. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.